Well, 13 News Now is your back to school station, and as summer vacation winds down, there's a growing crisis in education, an extreme shortage of teachers, and Virginia isn't immune to this. Even Governor Glenn Youngkin admits there are some real challenges in fully staffing our schools. A lot of it brought on by the pandemic and low pay. A major crisis in many American school districts, not enough teachers. With just weeks until school starts, districts in Wisconsin. As of today, we have 16 teaching openings for the upcoming year. And in Florida, with 200 jobs recently still unfilled. It's across the board in every position. Across the U.S., thousands of unfilled classroom jobs are the result of so many teachers this year deciding to quit. I was definitely very emotional about leaving the kids. Um, but I just started to realize that I needed to do it for myself. A 2022 study by a Texas teachers union reports that 66 percent of members considered quitting recently for reasons including increased workload, concerns for safety and low pay. Would you stay in your job if you aren't paid enough based on your education and your experience? A lot of good teachers have left and they are leaving. The exodus is still happening. Districts have responded in multiple ways, by increasing class sizes to reducing the school week, neither ideal for students. And some are now dangling financial incentives. Des Moines, Iowa media reports that districts are promising a $50,000 bump in retirement benefits for some teachers just to stay through the coming school year. And in D.C., the district's offering signing bonuses of up to $2,500 to teachers for high-demand subjects. They're hoping this will be enough to fill those jobs. Well, last month, Virginia Beach City Public Schools Superintendent Dr. Aaron Spence recommended a 5% total pay increase for all staff across the division. And in Portsmouth and Hampton, the superintendents won a 5% raise for all staff. Norfolk superintendent recommends average teacher pay increases just under 6% with a list of pay bonuses. Chesapeake's proposal includes a 3.5% bump for starting teacher salaries and Suffolk's average teacher raises would be above 7%.